All right, so virtual classroom templates, that's a little misleading. We look at this, like, Brian, that's only for people who are teaching students online. Ah, don't, not quite, not quite. I think there's lots of value here because this gives your students a visual, a very, some of you, most of you are very organized people, a very organized visual of all the things happening in school that day. And so, well, Brian, I got a whiteboard. It's different because all the things here are, are linked, hyperlinked to all the things that you want them to have access to. So think about directions, what to do at a center, what to do with this assignment, something you created, maybe something somebody else created. We're talking about hyperlinks, right? It's visually, it's, a, it's appealing. What about students who get done with assignments? There's something for them. Like, hey, there's this, there's this new joke of the day. Here is a, some kind of how to draw a giraffe video. Um, you know, things like that. My favorite book. Here's our books that we're studying. Holidays, things like that. So let me, let me get you started really how to make this happen. So Canva makes this easy. You got to have a free Canva account. You just say sign up now, uh, the canva.com slash education. You get your account. You type in virtual classroom. They give you these wonderful templates. Choose one that you like. I chose one here. And what's cool about it is they give you all the image resources. But if you don't like those, you just come over here and upload your own. So it could be a picture of you. It could be a picture of the book, whatever you need there. You put it up here and then you need to link things. So let's say you're a music teacher. Well, the, the saxophone button needs to take them to the saxophone help video or something. You know, that's this kind of thing or a book. It takes them to the book. So I click this. I click the link button up here and already have something because I put it in there. I paste it. I say, okay, we're good. We're good. And then I hit share and there's this view only link. And that's where the magic really happens. I click this. I have the link. Anybody gets that link. They have access to all my hyperlinks within this document. I come up here. Let's try it. Let's see if it works. There's the link. Here it is. And if they, they click on the saxophone, it actually takes them to my Flipgrid video. Oh, there's my timer. I did great. I did great. Uh, it takes to my Flipgrid video where I'm showing them what to do at a certain center. And Flipgrid, of course, is like the most simple way to make a video up here at the top with the camera button. And it gives you a link, like just like that. Boom. You're not uploading anything, none of that mess. So that's how you can still use virtual classrooms to keep everything nice and organized, give students a very visually appealing way to access all their content. How'd I do? Two minutes. I do okay, everybody? I hope so.